Hi everybody, I'm Philip Duncan. Thanks for joining us for our Thursday weather video brought to you by Country TV on Sky Channel 081. Well, all the uh, parents and grandparents, anyone looking after the kids for the school holidays at the moment, will be pretty happy with the forecast. Not only have we got high pressure dominating this week, but also next week. But it's not quite straightforward because we do have one feature coming in for the weekend with a burst of heavy rain. This is the satellite map for Thursday, not much to talk about. A little bit of low cloud here and there. This is the only thing of interest actually. Tropical cyclone Amos has formed. It's just to the northeast of Fiji. It might affect parts of Samoa. At this stage it's not posing a serious threat though, but it is one to keep a little eye on up here. It's just formed. So let's take a look at the next couple of days around New Zealand and with the high centred right out here east of the Chatham Islands means we're on the left hand side of it or the western side of it and what that means is we get more cloud, more humidity uh, in that northerly wind flow. So as a result of that or easterly wind flow up in the north here you'll see a few showers, a bit of cl cloud around, a couple of showers. It's still a fairly dry day but there will be a few showers hanging around there. One or two also coming in around Taranaki in the coastal areas and a few showers also on the west coast. It's a warm day I mean it's pretty warm as we get into the afternoon Afternoon. Northland's heading for a high of around 20, uh, sorry, Southland's heading for a high of around 23. Northland's got a high of 21. So Southland's warmer than Northland on Friday as a result of the warmer winds curving down there for you and probably a bit sunnier than uh, up there in the north. As we head in towards the long weekend, it's a bit wet on Saturday to start with. Big downpours here. Watch for very heavy downpours on the west coast. We've got a subtropical burst of air coming into it, but the good news is the front is moving through quite quickly. Uh, and You'll see that here on Sunday. This is where it lies on Sunday lunchtime. So by the end of Sunday, it should have cleared to the north of the country and then there's a south to southwest flow behind it, clearing up for Monday. So that's the forecast. Don't forget for the 10 minute long 10 day forecast, you can visit Sky Channel 081 Country TV.